top Had a dream, I was riding around the city in a drop top Wristwatch, wristwatch Had a dream, I just got the new rollie on TikTok Pour it up, pour it up Don Perry on, drink it out the big cup yeah. Roll it up, roll it up Pass it all around cause it's all love Real ones surrounding me Good vibes is all I need Yeah, I know they wanna see me low For reasons I won't know But I got some real hitters with me Hello you guys, welcome back to the vlog It is Friday it's currently 8.49. Ooh, I need to go get ready. Um, I'm going to a yoga class this morning. You guys are actually just sitting on my matcha that I made. I've just been sitting outside. It's like a lovely morning. I feel like it's not even 80 degrees, which is like unheard of for a summer morning in Florida. It's 78 degrees right now. So, so pretty. Um, I am going to a yoga class today and then my husband is also off. It's so it's gonna be a super fun um day but we're gonna go get our nails done he always gets a pedicure when i get a manicure so i don't know what color i'm gonna do because these are gonna be my europe nails so i feel like i'm overthinking it <laughs> like what i'm gonna do because anyway it doesn't it doesn't really matter whether you're in america or europe what your nail color is but um yeah so i'm gonna go get my we're gonna go get our nails done and then that's really the only plans I have for today our house cleaners are coming so that's gonna be nice but even like this whole weekend we don't really have any plans which I can't tell you the last time we had like a no plan weekend so I think it'll be kind of nice we've been enjoying using our pool on like summer nights and stuff so I don't know maybe we'll just like get a little tan today I have no clue like what we're going to get into this weekend so should be a fun round one most of our friends are out of town so I think it's just gonna be like me and my husband um chilling <laughs> this weekend maybe going to dinner maybe doing a little shopping we leave for Europe in a week and a half you guys and I have not gotten my passport yet so I'm a little nervous about that I'm thinking maybe Monday I might need to go to one of those places where you can get your passport done super fast if I don't get it in the mail today or tomorrow because then it will be like a week and I haven't gotten it yet so I don't know what to do I'm kind of freaking out about that but I keep like pushing it out of my mind and then sadly freaking out about it like every morning when I wake up I'm like oh my god I don't have my passport yet so I don't know keep you guys updated on that but we're gonna go to a yoga class this morning welcome back to the vlog good morning i got some real things on my mind and no it ain't you no i don't want no problems i got dreams i ain't far from but i got some real here few hours later <laughs> actually several hours later i don't even know what the last clip that you guys saw was but we have been busy, but not with like hard stuff. I am just getting ready right now. I'm throwing on just a little bit of makeup and breaking out. I don't know why I'm breaking out, but I just am. And I want to film a TikTok. So just putting on a little bit of makeup. I just got a pair of cowboy boots in the mail, which I'm super excited about because in two weeks your girl's gonna be in europe and i'm going to the taylor swift switzerland concert the eras tour in switzerland in i guess three weeks from now and my outfit is giving debut so i feel like it had to go with cowboy boots so i just ordered a pair they came in today i got them from altered state actually i will show them to you guys but I think that they are going to be super cute and go perfectly with the outfit, but I want to try the outfit on. You guys will see it when we are in Switzerland, but anyway, we have been busy, busy, busy. I got my nails done. I took my acrylics off. I had acrylics. I just like felt like acrylics aren't good for your nails, which I guess technically like dip or gel really isn't either, but 
I was just like, please take it off. I want really short because I'm gonna be gone. I'm not gonna be like able to get my nails done for four weeks. So I went super short and um, I got a pedicure too, which I never get pedicures, you guys. I hate when people touch my feet. Like in the nail salon, my feet are just really ticklish. So I did that. It took forever. And then Seth and I ran some errands as well. I had to like deposit a check. What else did I do? I ran to Marshalls. I got a few good things from Marshalls. I was looking for a pair of sandals and I found literally the exact pair that I felt like I was looking for. So I'll show you guys that too in a second. I'm just going to film this really quickly because I really want to put on like I want to put the outfit together and see what it looks like it's almost five o'clock so I think I'm, after I do this I think I'm gonna go like lay in the pool or something but these are the boots how freaking perfect are these I wish you guys could see my dress but I don't want to show you yet I want you to like stay tuned for all of the content there but they literally go together perfectly just know that I picked up these shoes from Marshalls today. They're from Madden Girl. They're in a size seven. They are absolutely perfect. They're exactly what I was looking for for Europe. I just want something that has like a back, but is super cute, versatile. I also just picked up this red top from there because I thought it was super cute as well. And you could wear this with jeans, shorts. I could wear them with like my linen pants or even like a long white maxi skirt. This would be super cute with. Okay, I need you guys' opinion. This is something else that I have recently got in the mail. I got it from dish d-i-s-s-h i saw it on tiktok and i just absolutely fell in love with it my mirror for some reason and like the lighting in this room is so terrible so i don't know if you can really tell honestly let me get my um hold on one second okay because i genuinely want you guys' opinions <laughs> i'm using my light ring but this is the dress so I saw it on TikTok. I thought it was so cute on the girl. And I think it has so much potential. Like I love how simple it is yet very elevated. I think it's just too long on me. Like I think that it would look better if you could like see, like if it was, I don't know, not all the way down essentially. So what do you guys think? Do you guys think that I should like go and spend the money to get this tailored? Or do you think I should just send this back and be like, it just didn't work because I'm open to either one like I won't be hurt but good morning you guys I'm on my phone camera right now because I can't find my real camera I don't know where I have placed it and yeah so it's Saturday morning I'm just drinking myself a matcha I went to bed not actually went to bed I fell asleep on the couch last night at 10 o'clock and I woke up this morning at 9 o'clock like I got up Seth like watched a movie and then woke me up and I like brushed my teeth and everything and went back to bed but I got so much sleep last night which is good because I have been very very tired <laughs> so yeah I am booked for yoga class this morning at 11 o'clock it's almost 10 o'clock right now and then I don't know what I want to do for the day I do have like some returns that I have to make at what's that place called I bought that red dress. You guys know what I'm talking about. What is that store called? They just opened a storefront in Tampa. Frick. Um, I can't remember what it's called. It's not Revolve. It's like an expensive store. But anyway, there's one in Hyde Park in Tampa. So I need to take back something that I got from there. That blue shirt that you guys will have seen. Would have seen if you watched my tiktok about it and it just it didn't work out for me and i have a few things i need to take back from zara so like maybe we'll do that today i'm just feeling like a day on the town because we were at home a lot of yesterday so i want to be like out and about sometimes if i'm home too much i start to get sad <laughs> it's just like a fun fact i i love to be home i am a homebody but i'm not like like i need to get out of the house essentially today use this morning my sidekick always by me located my camera <laughs> i just got back ate literally an english muffin for breakfast and i'm about to take my dogs to the park we like to go to the park on saturday mornings just to get a lot of their energy out you guys might close it i don't know you guys don't spend a lot of time in here with me but it's kind of honestly a mess one of my goals is to get my closet redone like professionally 
because it just needs a ton of help. <sighs> I'm just putting on a shirt and I think I'm gonna bring my husband's computer to the park and start editing last week's vlog that I put up tomorrow because I put up a video every Sunday. I felt like I just heard the garage door open and maybe my husband was coming home, but um, yeah, so I think I'm going to edit that while they play so I can like bust out a few things at one time. Let me see. You have a ball? Let's go get a little tan out in the pool. I desperately need it. I am looking very, very pale. This swimsuit is from, what's it called? Strawberry Milk Mob. It's super cute. It is much later now, but we got a bunch of rain. Boys, hey, cut it out. I think we're are gonna go to dinner, but in the meantime, I'm just sitting and editing this week's vlog. I think we're gonna take the boys for a walk and then we'll get ready and I think we're gonna do pizza tonight for dinner, so should be fun. Date night. Date night? Cause it's ladies With the night. Fox. <laughs> Check out my outfit really quickly. Top is from Marshall's, I just got it yesterday. And then, sorry, this is so far away. And you can hear like a bunch of stuff in the back, but the bottoms are from, or the skirt is from Aritzia. Hi. <laughs> Seth is leaving me. And I put on earrings, which I never put on earrings. So I'm excited. We're getting pizza and some cocktails. <laughs> Yeah, I know they wanna see me low for reasons I won't know. But I got some real hitters with me, and they might shoot. Okay. It is Sunday morning, I guess probably mid afternoon now. It's 12 10 on Sunday. And we had a great night last night. We went to get pizza, and then we got cookies from our favorite little cookie place in Tampa. And then we drove around, there's this place in Tampa, it's called Davis Island, that has like a bunch of really nice, beautiful homes that we drove around and looked at the homes there, and then we came home, so it was pretty chill. And now, this morning, I've just been doing some stuff on my computer, so I got my uh, vlog posted for today, made some breakfast, made some breakfast tacos, and now Seth is mowing the lawn. I have washed the carpet. Um, what's I think all that vacuum that you can do to like pull dirt out of the carpet? I just did that for our living room carpet and put in a load of laundry. And it is gonna storm this afternoon, but the UV is seven right now. So I wanna go out and get a little bit of sun before the storm comes. I think it's supposed to come out one. And it's 12 12 now, so that's what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna throw on my bathing suit from yesterday and get a little bit of sun, putting on sunscreen, but yeah. Back in from tanning. The weather actually held off for two hours, so I spent two hours outside in the pool and then just like laying out in the sun. Switched the laundry in between, and now I have actually just made myself a piece of toast with some leftover. Um, Food scramble that I made this morning. It's gonna be my lunch. It's like 206. So perfect time for lunch. I'm just putting some um, ketchup on it. Don't judge me. I know this is a very weird meal, but it's just gonna be like a day at home. I think after I finish this, I'm going to just kind of like organize, pick up some stuff. Seth is at his old job. He's working that job for the next week with his current job. So he's gonna have two jobs for the next week. But he is there right now, helping with the basketball camp. And then I'll probably be home. I don't know, like we don't have any plans today, which is nice. So we we'll just, you know, enjoy a Sunday. Camper, I got you a present, come here. Oh! 
Although this summer I turned pretty was so bad last summer, I feel like I am going to rewatch it because I am kind of sad that there's not a new one this summer. I just love like the vibes that it gives essentially. Makes me think of every summer when I used to go to the Outer Banks with my family, which I am missing this summer to go to Europe. So I just like, just want to have that feeling, you know? Whoa, why are we so close? Let's do a little Marshalls haul. I picked up some really cute things. I, for some reason, have been on Marshalls TikTok or technically TJ Maxx TikTok. But the TJ Maxx beside me, it's not really beside me. Like, it's kind of far, so I don't really ever go to it. But there's a Marshalls beside me that is really good. Look what I found. This is so cute. I think, I don't know what I'm gonna put in it. I don't use my coffee machine anymore because I don't drink coffee, but my husband does. So I'm thinking about putting like cute little coffee pods in there. Cause I think that will be so cute. Like I can put it over here with our coffee pods. I love it. I think it is so cute. This area is going to look so much cuter after we get the kitchen redone as well. And the red will look really cute with like the white countertops and the backsplash and the green cabinets. Like it's going to look so cute. I also picked up some jewelry because I've just been noticing recently that I I don't change out my jewelry really ever, which is fine, but I kind of want to, especially for going to Europe. So first I picked up this little bracelet. I'm not sure if it's gonna focus. You guys know my camera has such a hard time focusing. There we go. Got this cute little evil eye bracelet. I wanted it to be an anklet, but it doesn't fit around my ankle. So I'm a little bit sad about that. And then I also got the cutest little earrings. They're on sale for $10. And I just thought that they were so cute. I'm gonna have to show them to you guys like this. I just love the red and like the detail is so pretty. I'm actually gonna put them in right now because I'm not the type of person who can wait. Like I, whenever I get new stuff, I'm like, oh, I want to try on all of it. So cute, I love the red. So that'll be fun for like a red outfit that I have for Europe. And then what else? Just got a little sponge holder for our sink. And then Seth saw this on the way out and he was like, hmm, this looks nice. So he picked up that, but that is all that we got from Marshalls. We've been really into Marshalls lately. <laughs> Drop top, drop top Had a dream I was riding around the city in a drop top Wristwatch, wristwatch Had a dream I just got the new rollie on TikTok Pour it up, pour it up Don Perry on, drink it out the big cup yeah. Roll it up, roll it up Pass it all around cause it's all love Real ones surrounding me Good vibes is all I need yeah, I know they wanna see me low For reasons I won't know But I got some real hitters with me here And they might shoot, shoot, shoot. I got some real things on my mind And no, it ain't you. ain't you No, I don't want no problems I got dreams I ain't far from But I got some real hitters with me here Grocery haul <laughs> I'm filming just got back from Trader Joe's and Publix. I'll start over here. This is the stuff. I think we might have gotten some other things from Publix that are in there, but um, I love getting these Unreals. They're really good and not very high in calories, so a great little sweet treat. Huh? Shut it. This is my favorite cashew milk for my matchas, and then we always get some poppies, so raspberry rose, ginger lime, 
cola. I'm gonna make a bunch of mocktails this week. So I got a bunch of that and then some regular sparkling, wa sparkling water and then Seth really likes Topo Chico. Honey, do you wanna give them a grocery haul? You're doing a great job, right? <laughs> Japanese fried rice, these are Seth's favorite. Some Impossible Burger, vegan cheese. We're gonna make like an enchilada type thing. I'm gonna use that for this week. Some tahine for mocktails. Greek yogurt, overnight oats, tofu. We're gonna make some orzo. I forget, it's like a sun-dried tomato orzo. And then, I don't know why we got this pasta. I got some of these. I used to get these a lot. They're pretty good. Not great, but pretty good. And then, I got so much stuff for mocktails. I think I overdid it. I got this sparkling coconut water with yuzu. What the heck is that? I don't know what that is. Yuzu mushrooms, some spices, and I also picked up this bourbon vanilla bean paste that I thought would be good in matcha, onions, avocados, croutons, ginger, mint, cherries. I think it's cherry season. We got some vegetables over here and then some protein bars. This is Seth's tangerine juice. A bunch of milk options, broth, bread. Oh shoot, you got peanut butter with honey? Um, ramen. <laughs> Some enchilada sauce, our favorite bread, and then I also got red tart cherry juice for mocktails. We're going to be drinking a lot of mocktails this week, so <laughs> we got a bunch of stuff for mocktails. For dinner tonight, I am making this black bean enchilada skillet meal. It looks so good. It's vegan, but you could definitely make it vegetarian if you wanted to or even like add meat. I feel like it's super versatile. The recipe is from Dietitian, Dietitian Debbie, but I'll show you guys the final product because I'm filming for TikTok as well. So I'll show you guys the final product. My shoe, my shoe, don't move, boss things, boss things, young man, how you doing, boss things, Ooh, big dreams, big dreams, mama says, son, you gon' do big things. You just gotta, you just gotta go get it. Money piling up like we about to go swimming. Gotta play the game.